Hi, in this movie uh, I'm going to show you how to configure the window blind controller which is connected to our uh, system bus. So as always, uh, we got on the top of the controller we got uh, address deep switch and of course the manual override deep switch. So like uh, in the other modules we're using a deep switch number 7 over here to turn on, on the manual override and as you can see we can turn the, ma the manual Mm, we can turn the outputs manually without any problems, but we have to be careful in this case because uh, if we're going to turn the 1 and 2 output uh, in the same time, so it means that we're going to power the engine of the window blend up and down in the same time, so we can break uh, engines. So uh, I would really advise you to turn off mm, the manual override mode if not necessary. Okay, the module is built uh, very familiar to, to our 8 output rely module. So as you can see on the side we got 1, 2, 3 and 4 uh, outputs. And over here we got uh, 8 inputs uh, so we can connect a regular window blitz, window blitz switch. And we can install this switch very close to the window so we can manually uh, control the window blitz. So up, down. Uh, or we can put other functions, of course, we can program those functions inside the module, uh, inside the menu of this module. Uh, so, to program the module, uh, as always, we have, to, uh, we have to log in into our service menu, passwords, and expansion cards, two canvas expander, list of network utilities and we got a blinds controller over here as you can see uh, on a green. So right now we have to name it uh, blinds of course that name can be uh, different uh, we got the add physical address number 3 and add so we got our window blinds over here and of course we are adding new output and over here we have to add a window blind number one so we're gonna just call it blind blind number one enter over here we are choosing which output we are configurating so this is gonna be output number one and over here we have to put um, the time A and output B time this means, uh, for instance, we can put uh, 30 seconds and over here like 35 seconds. So it means that um, the window blind is going to be activated for 30 seconds when we're going to put it down. And if we want to put the window blind up, uh, the engine is going to work for 35 seconds. So we're setting here the time, uh, how long the engine should work while uh, driving the, the blind up and down. Of course, we can also set a pulse time. This pulse time means uh, how much time uh, the windows, sh the, the engine should be on. Uh, actually, the clutch on the engine should be on when we try to um, change the angle of the blend. So this is a very important function. You can also see that in our instruction manual. Uh, but right now we're gonna set zero. It's not necessary. Oh, I can do that. So we're gonna set one. No, 10, okay, so we're gonna set 10, that's it. Okay, over here we got uh, input 1 and input 2. It means that we can uh, connect two separate local switches and the one switch is gonna, uh, is gonna be responsible for uh, making the window blinds, window blind go up and the second one is gonna be responsible for putting the window blind down. So over here we got a lot of different configurations of course and there is like a lot of it. So we, we're not going to talk about it right now but we're going to do it like this. Return turn A and over here return turn B. So right now when we're going to click on the first switch uh, the window blind is going to go uh, up from the upper position. Uh, excuse me, for the upper position, yes, to the, to the, to the lower position, so it's going to go down, of course. And uh, over here, we, uh, when we're going to press the second switch, the window blend is going to go uh, up from the lower position uh, to the uh, top of the window. So right now we're pressing OK, we're saving, 
And as you can see over here, if we're going to click on blends, uh, all blends, we got up, stop, down, stop. And you can also see it uh, on our uh, LED uh, display on the top of the module that everything is working right now. Of course, you can do exactly the same with all the rest uh, window blends. So all the rest outputs on the same module. Uh, it's uh, very easy and so I wish you good luck.